Have you ever wondered what the best still books to pick up in the month of November were? Well, let's talk about it. Today, I'm back with another top five physical media ranking video for you all. Today, I'm gonna ranking my favorite still books that came out in the month of November from the worst to the best. Now, this is just my own personal ranking list. So I know everybody's rankings out there is gonna be completely different. Go ahead and leave your list down in the comments below as I go through my own. But starting with number five, I'm gonna have to put Groove's first exclusive still book, and that is gonna have to be Eight Mile on 4K Steelbook. Now I put this one at the bottom because I thought the design artwork was pretty simple, even though it does work fine for the movie. And then also there was no new special features. Some of the old special features were really cool, kind of how they got extras into the movie for the rap battles, I did like that. But once again, just nothing new and super special here, but the 4K quality overall, I thought was great. Movie looked great, sounded great to me, can't complain too much, so hopefully Groove keeps doing more awesome still books. All right, next up is gonna be number four. And this was a first time watch for me. I could have got the Blu-ray still book way back when, but I had a feeling 4K was coming out. So I held off and now I picked up one of the best comedies of all time. And that is gonna be Wayne's World. Yes, Wayne World is so fun. Just a great comedy. I mean, a dynamic duo here with Wayne and Garth. Their chemistry is perfect. Just hilarious buddies in here doing a cool kind of video podcast type of show with silly, funny humor. Just was cracking me up from start to finish. So the characters in here are great. I love how when it gets to the ending, there's like multiple endings. So really well put together story. And just if you're a comedy fan, you can't really go wrong with it. Now I put this one a little bit lower on the list because yeah, it's the same still book from the Blu-ray, so they get dinged for that. But overall, I think the 4K quality is there. Looked and sounded good, solid to me, but just nothing special in terms of special features on this one either, like 8 Mile. So yeah, that's why those two had to go at the bottom. But both great movies. Can't complain there. All these are wonderful movies. All right, now getting into our top three spots here. So third place is going to be a great sci-fi action war movie that I remember from the 90s fondly. And that is going to be Starship Troopers. Look at this design. This is such a cool artistic design for the movie. I love the look of that. Just the colors really pop. Really, really cool. But Excellent movie. I enjoy this one. The special features were solid in here and there's actually quite a bit of special features and they even did have a new special feature of like a zoom call where uh, the cast members were talking with each other kind of reminiscing about making the movie which I thought was fascinating so I really did like that. Uh, looks and sounds great. Again 4k is definitely there with this one. So yeah art design. I mean just all around a really cool pickup for a still book. So this way I it gets a little bit higher up on the list. All right, now we're getting into our top two here. So getting into my runner up second place, and I'm gonna have to go with this one. This is tough decisions here, but gonna have to go with Reservoir Dogs. I mean, this still book is absolutely awesome with the plastic slip cover giving it extra protection. I love that. This is a great Quentin Tarantino film, kind of a little bit of a thriller mystery in there, kind of trying to piece together what went wrong with this crew. So I love that part of it. And it's not a super long movie, doesn't overstay its welcome. But once again, the slipcover, look at that with the ear. Ooh, just such a cool design. So because of that art design right there, this one had to get higher towards the top. 4K quality looks sounds great just like these other ones so definitely just all around uh it could have improved maybe on the special features i will say that uh but in terms of art design for a still book just that just took this one way up on my list i could not resist so really cool design but once again lionsgate has not been disappointing on those plastic slipcover still books they just do a wonderful job all right now to get into number one first place and yeah, I probably put this one here because it is my favorite movie of the year. And I know I'm going to be watching this one a whole bunch of times. Uh, so yeah, that did kind of 
get in there and made me put this one first place. So this is gonna be Top Gun Maverick Steelbook. Now overall, I do like the design. I don't think it's amazing or super special, but it's good. It works for the movie, can't complain there. But the 4K, we talk about 4K collecting this kind of ultra high definition. This movie is stunning on physical media. It is so sharp, especially just how they filmed all the flying sequences. It is just amazing, blows me away. It is excellent. This movie sounds great with all the jet engines. I mean, ooh, and the musical soundtrack. It's just, oh, it's all so good. Just even talking about the movie more makes me want to watch it right now. So when a movie can do that, I have to put it number one first place. Just the quality is there for the movie itself, the 4K, the art design, like I said, maybe could have been slightly improved to do something super unique and different, but works fine for the movie, so can't complain too much there. I think the special features were solid on this one. Of course, it's new special features because it's the first time this movie is coming out. Uh, so you do get those. Would have liked probably more special features. Some of them be a little bit longer, but it does have some special features. So just to see the making of the movie is cool enough. So yeah, how to put Top Gun Maverick at that first place spot. And if you missed any of those full unboxings and reviews of those individual steelbooks and you want more of those great details, I have videos for all of those. Those are going to be linked in the description below. You can definitely click some of those right now. And if you're visiting the channel for the very first time and you love collecting physical media and being part of this awesome league of mega film fans, make sure you subscribe right now. That way you stay entertained and up to date on all the latest physical media topics. The end is inevitable, Maverick. You kind of set it for extinction. Maybe so, sir. But not today. And if you enjoy this physical media topic video, Click another video to see more. Also like the video, and this is Mega Mike the Movie Man reminding you to make every day a movie day.